Hello guys, it's Lee, Lana, and Millie back there. We are Saturday morning. We set our alarm for five o'clock and we left around six. We're a couple hours north into Kentucky, fixing to go to Indiana for, of course, we're picking up a mower. And it is, well, you can't tell probably, snowing. snowing. Got a little snow out there. And it is 28 degrees. It's November 2022. More to come. You can really see it, but it's very snowy. So that's what we got. A wheel horse. Toro wheel horse 522XI. Same as the front end loader I got. More to come. And there's my wife. If you like this kind of video, subscribe to this channel. Hey guys, it's Lee, and it is probably a two days later, and I'm showing you the Wheel Horse Toro Wheel Horse 522 XI. Hey, I got two of them. They're in the background, kind of faded, blurry, but I just wanted to um, do a walk around. Now, the one I'm really showing you is the one I just got which is identical to the other, but it's gonna be a walk around today. Um, we had to go to Indiana to get it. It was, for me, that's two hours, 40 minutes, one way, and then I had to get home. So, um, Lana, my wife, and Millie went with me, and we just made a day of it. It snowed, so that was fun. It is kind of mid-November of 2022, so let's go over there and look at them. I'll let the engine run on both of them. It's probably 30, maybe 40 degrees yet. Today, the high is gonna be 50. It's been sitting on the trailer for a couple of days. Hey, I do have the back hubcaps for that. They're in the back of the truck and um, they need cleaning up. But if you can see right here, 522XI, that's what this is over here, 522XI. So this is my second wheel horse to own. Obviously the, the front end loader, that's my pride and joy, but you know, I've only had it for a few months. So I don't really know that much about these, but I love the year that these were made for garden tractors. 
I mean, this is the last of a dying breed because now you have to go up to the Kubota BXs and stuff like that to get this kind of quality in a garden tractor, which is, you know, if you got a front end loader on one, man, one of those are, I don't know what, 15,000. But anyway, so the unique thing I like about this is they have power steering. That's why, so there's a 518 XI, and somebody correct me if I'm wrong, it does not have the power steering. Even though it's a great machine, don't get me wrong, it's a wonderful machine, it just don't have the power steering. And I've never driven one, so maybe it don't need it that much. But this does, that does, and with the front end loader, that's pretty important. Both of these have, you know, they're identical in every way that I can tell. If, if you guys know a difference in these two, let me know. But they both have a 22 horse Kohler. I'm not gonna pop the hood there because it's, they're identical. Um, and I've had a couple in the back that has a 22 horse Kohler and I've never had any issues with that. I believe these have the heavier cast iron rear ends, which is a big deal. Um, you know, like I say, this is equipped for heavy stuff. Uh, with the front end loader, it works well. It's easy to turn with a full load. And the reason I say that is because I got, and I'll show a picture of it here, but I got a yard man in the back with a 22 horse Kohler, and it's a great machine but it does not have power steering, and that's the downfall to that, I think. Um, so I was just excited about finding this that close to me. There's not that many out there for sale. And if you watch any of my videos, you know I'm always about a bargain, so I think, and I'm not gonna tell you how much I paid for it, because I just don't think that's right to talk about that stuff, but I got, a, got that at a decent price. I'm not saying it's a bargain, but I didn't overpay for it, I don't think. As long as this is as good a shape of as I think it is, and I don't, I can't tell anything's wrong with it at this point. I mean, if there's anything wrong with it, I don't know. Um, it's got the 60 inch deck, which I have a 60 inch deck for that, but it'll never go on there because I can't do it with that front end loader. So it's sitting in the back. Um, I'll either use it for parts for this one, or maybe I'll sell it. I don't know, but it's there. I mean, since I got this, I'll probably keep it. Just some future plans for this. I've already been thinking I'll probably, we'll put dualies on this because I'll put a wheel weight here and then another. I'll probably take those wheels actually on that one and put them as the second set of wheels on here. And then I'll take something completely different to put on that one. And then I'll cover it up and I'll use the hubcaps on that one over there because the paint won't match up exactly. I don't know, it's all new to me. Uh, wheel horses are new. If there's any problems all to be looking out for, feel free to mention them in the comments. Um, if you think I got a good machine, mention them in the comments. Cause like I say, I'm new to wheel horse and these, but I love this year. Now I'll probably look at some other wheel horses in the future because once I buy one or two and I like them, then I'll go for them. Um, I'll show you a little bit about my- This right here is the, um, Yardman 999, it's got hydraulic uh, three-point hitch on it, which those don't have. The, but this is my other one that I compare it to. Look, it's got a front end loader on it too. But this, the down, so this has got the 22 horse Kohler, 22 horse Kohler. The problem with this is no power steering. So if you got a full load in the bucket, you got to steer real cautiously so you don't strip out of gear or whatever. Now I do love these 15 inch wheels. I get good traction on that. Oh, I got some other ones here. I got a Sears Suburban in the shed. I got a Craftsman 2 with electronic lift in the shed. What else I got? Oh, I just got another basic mower. That's probably gonna be for sale. But anyway, this is just me doing a quick video wheel horse 522 xi i mean i got two of them so there they are the rear of them i'm pretty excited about it um hey if you um have not yet subscribed to my channel go ahead and do that I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers hey while i'm thinking about it online i got hoodies and t-shirts for sale with murphy mower on it
don't have on one right now. I'm just out here thinking about it. In the description of this video, I'm gonna put a link and that's where you get them at. I mean, the t-shirts are 20 something dollars and the hoodies are, I think 30 something dollars, which if you're gonna buy a hoodie, you're gonna pay that much anyway. So you might as well have a little tractor on it and it is getting close to Christmas. So that'd be a good Christmas present. Anyway, I think that's the end of my video. Hey, I appreciate it. Uh, comment on these. Subscribe to my channel. I'm out.